Hello YouTube! I am Pinstar and this is Two Point Hospital Strategy and Tactics Quick Tip. So today, and actually this week, we are going to be reviewing different combos of uh, different uh, uh, snack and drink machines. Uh, there are a number of varieties that are available, uh, both uh, with the standard game as well as a much larger variety that come with the DLCs. And we're going to be uh, um, going over some certain build mechanics and design philosophies for which ones you use. Um, and is also how you how this may uh, impact the design of your hospital. Um, so the number one uh, suggestion that I have right now is um, don't use uh, more than one type of the same type. What I mean by that is if you're going to use, in this case, briny brittle as your snack machine, don't do a non-briny brittle snack machine elsewhere, or people may go wandering far to try and find their favorite snack. You obviously are going to have different machines for a snack and drink. That's fine. Just stay consistent. So each of these builds are going to assume that you are decking out your whole hospital with the same snack and the same drink machines, but choosing what combination is, well, our focus here. And this particular build here, I like to call the salt shaker build because it's uh, it's kind of a weird one, but strangely effective. So here we've got our um, uh, we've got a consultant here, Dr. Rodney Duckworth, and he is exhausted. He's just about to go on break. Um, he is thirsty. He is tired. So let's see. Uh, let's follow him along. Let's see how he does here. We've got some snack machines nearby. He's thirsty. All right, go ahead. Have that. Uh, have, have that um, have that drink there. Now notice what just happened. By drinking the palpitation, not only does he run faster, but his energy spiked up. Specifically, it spiked up by a rapid 10%. All right, time to use the bathroom. No, no real getting around that, but um, as long as he can get his uh, his stuff out here, uh, he'll uh, he'll he'll be all good here. Now let me let's see if he does the other aspect of this build. It's not oh it doesn't always happen. Okay, good. He's hungry. He's hungry. So that means he's gonna go and uh, go go seeking uh, some something to eat. Uh, probably some uh, briny brittle. There we go. Boom. Now the thing with briny brittle is um, yeah it satisfies hungry hunger, but it drops his uh, thirst need, so makes him uh, thirsty. Again. What does that do? That brings him right back to the palpitation. Um, and uh, boom, 100% energy. We got two ticks of that uh, of that 10% energy boost. Now notice something here. He's done with his break. Um, he, he doesn't need to go anywhere because somebody else replaced him and, and didn't go on break. But he's essentially ready and raring to go. He's got energized. He's got an energy buzz. He's happy. But notice one thing. He didn't go to a break room. That's because this particular hospital doesn't have any break rooms at all. Anywhere. Nope. The Salt Shaker build replaces the need for a break room by loading your uh, your staff and your patients up with salt and more specifically a double dose of palpitation. Uh, now they don't always uh, take two of those but the salt makes it more likely that they are going to take two hits of palpitation and get that 20% boost to their stamina. Um, so um, this can, th I'll, I'll tell you there's some downsides to this. Um, it wreaks havoc on your, well, I wouldn't say wreaks havoc. It, 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 it hits your garbage cans harder because both patients and, um, uh, doctors and, and nurses and staff are all going to be using the machines a lot more frequently than they do, which means the machines need to get restocked more frequently, which means there's going to be a lot more garbage, and also consequently there may be a few extra bathroom visits. Uh, but at the, on the flip side, you will save yourself your uh, hospital space by not having to build a single break room anywhere, and your uh, staff probably won't wander too far from their original room uh, because all they have to do is go to some nearby uh, snack machines and at the furthest go to the bathroom. Uh, so that is the salt shaker. Um, salt being for the salt and shaker being for what happens if you have a diet consisting of nothing of sodium and caffeine. Um, 
So if you guys uh, like this uh, episode and you want to see more like it, go ahead and hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and leave me a comment, good, bad, or indifferent. Your feedback's always welcome. So until next time, this has been Pinstar signing out. See ya!